Hi guys, look what came in the mail. My package, yay! I'm so excited. Um, I got this package from my friend Leah, um, who is part of the Hot Chicken family on YouTube. And I will have a video up with all the stuff that I'm going to send her. And so this is my unboxing of her box, and I'm just like beyond excited. Like I've had this for about four or five days, and I have waited for the perfect day to film this, and today is the first time I've gotten a chance to film it. So, um, yeah, I think I'm just going to jump into it. Alright, so this is her super cute box has really really cute duct tape on it. I've never seen duct tape but it looks like that. I wonder where she got it. Huh. Alright, got my handy dandy scissors. Okay. So here goes. Opening the box, opening the box. It's like Christmas and birthday all in one box. I, I almost don't even want to cut the duct tape because it's so pretty. Yay! Okay. Alright, there's a card in here. Let me open that first. You're so, if, oh, <laughs> thank you. You're so sweet. That's this really, really pretty card. I love it. I'm gonna put this up somewhere because it's so pretty. Okay, where do I start? You guys see that? This is really unique packing material. I have never seen that. Oh, okay. Ooh. Is this a scarf? Oh my gosh. It's so soft and fuzzy. <sighs> oh my gosh. It's purple. Oh my goodness gracious. I shall put it on right now. It's actually really, really cold today. Wait, let me set this aside. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's an infinity scarf. Ha! <laughs> oh my gosh. So warm and fuzzy. Thanks, Leah. What else can I unwrap first? Oh. Okay, there's something that says open last. Happy birthday. And this is actually... Uh, my birthday was on January 28th, so it is kind of like a later birthday present. Um, and we started talking about this not too long after my birthday. And it's just kind of taken this long to get this thing rolling. So I will definitely open that last. Ooh. This sounds really good. And here's a gorgeous blue box. I'm seriously going to keep this box just to put something else in. Is that cool or what? I gotta know where she got this. Open first. It says Birchbox. 
I don't know. What does this mean? Ooh. So exciting. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is this? Beauty Junkie Non-Drying Shea Butter. Oh! It's a face mask. Oh, this looks really good. I love shea butter. It smells so amazing. That's actually one of my favorite smells. That's what that looks like. And I can't wait to try this. This looks so good. Oh my gosh. And I like the fact that it says non-drying because there are a lot of um, face masks and stuff that I've tried that even though they say like they're supposed to be gentle for your skin, I feel like my skin is just a desert or some weird analogy like that after I try them and they are just really harsh on my skin and so this looks amazing I can't wait to try this thanks Leah okay the next thing in the box I don't know what to look at first oh my goodness this is literally like the perfect color. Oh my gosh. It's like pearly lavender. This is, this is, you picked like an amazing color. How'd you do that? <laughs> okay, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the label. Here, let's turn this upside down. Oh, you can't see it. Okay, it says nothing else metals. Oh, that is adorable. I love it. Oh, yay. I have way too much nail polish, but you know what? That's not even a thing. Why am I even saying that? Nobody can have too much nail polish. Right? Right? Okay. The next thing I see is a vanilla sugar, which is amazing scent. Moisturizing body lotion. Oh, it's from Ulta. Hmm. Oh my gosh, I gotta smell this, like right now. Oh my gosh. That smells amazing. I'm gonna put some on now because my hands are like super dry. Like, super, super dry. Yes! I love lotion so much. Oh my gosh, it feels really, really good. I hope you guys can hear me in this video. I'm not really sure. This is kind of a weird spot to film, I know, for this unboxing, but I honestly don't really have a lot of space other than being somewhere outside my home. To film right now, so oh, mm, it smells so good. I love it. Yay, that's definitely going in my purse after this. Okay, the next thing I see is looks like a a lipstick. Divine Goddess Lipstick. Ooh. <laughs> this, I've never seen this before. Ooh, so exciting. Let's see. Oh my gosh, this is so unique. What is this? Oh yes, that is perfect. That is literally perfect. I already have something on my lips right now, otherwise I would try to just swatch it on my lips, but oh my gosh. You did a great job picking this shade. Thanks so much. Okay. Oh, there's little bracelets in here. 
Oh, they're so cute. They're tiny bracelets. It says, oop, I totally just dropped that. It says love life and dream big. I wonder if you're supposed to wear them together. I shall put them together. Let's see how this works. Oh, these are so cute. I love them. And they're sparkly too. Oh, they look kind of sparkly to me. They're so cute. I used to collect things that has like little sayings on them, so it's kind of funny to think that you got me these. They're really, really cute. Oh, here's another Essie nail polish, and this is another. Oh my! I've never seen a color like this ever. It's kind of. Uh, I kind of want to say like um iridescent pink purple fuchsia oh my gosh it's gorgeous that is definitely a nail color for sure thanks so much oh my gosh it's called sure shot it's an interesting name yay Okay. Oh my gosh! Airy Fairy? This is like literally the first Rimmel lipstick that I have heard people talk about. Like when uh, YouTubers were first starting to be a thing, everyone, like literally everyone was talking about this shade. And it was supposedly like a dupe for some Mac, I forget what it's called, like Princess or something? There's probably not a name like that, but it seems like that would be a really good name. But it says, um, I don't know if you can see that. Fairy Fairy. I, actually, this is funny, because this is a uh, Rimmel lipstick that I'm wearing on now, and I love Rimmel so much. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. I don't really have very many new lipsticks. This is, like gorgeous oh my gosh I can't wait to wear this you know what I'm gonna swatch it on my wrist oh my gosh so pretty yay <laughs> okay oh and there's also a vanilla sugar shower gel awesome. I I have always loved things that come in a set, like um, especially mini, mini sizes. These things look so amazing. I have, oh my gosh, probably four or five different scents. Not, not from Ulta, because I don't really have an Ulta store around me, but um, I have so many different like travel sizes of like shower gels and stuff, but I don't have vanilla. So this is really, really great. This is perfect. Oh yay! <laughs> and then she got me two Rimmel eyeliners. Oh, it's so funny. I've actually wanted to get this so many times. I've looked at this particular one on the shelf. Every time I see this, I'm like, do I want it? Do I not? And this is the Scandalize Waterproof Coal Eyeliner. And I'm not sure if this is in a shade or not. I'm not seeing a name. Oh, there it is. Okay. It's in the shade. Oh, this is horrible. Nude. And... Yeah, it just looks like kind of a beige, nice beige color to brighten up your eyes and open up your eyes. 
So this I'm really looking forward to. Nice job picking that. And then a navy one. Oh yes. Yeah. So excited about this one. I'm going to swatch this. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. It's um kind of royal bluish. You see that? I love this. Oh my gosh, I just cannot wait to start using these. And it looks like that was all of that box. Okay. Thanks again, Leah. These are really, really well-picked products. I, I'm just beyond thankful that, A, that we are really, really... Um, I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm at loss for words right now. Um, I'm just really grateful for our friendship, and I hope we are in communication for a really, really long time, because you're just such an awesome person, and an awesome, encouraging, uplifting personality, and yeah, I'm just really grateful to know you. Okay, I want to see what this birthday thing is. This is the thing that says, um, open last. Okay. I might be able to get it with my fingers. Do, do. Seriously? You gotta be kidding me. Really? Oh my gosh. Are you for real? This is the first Urban Decay product I've ever owned. This is actually... This in the... One that has the rose gold tones in it, that's the other one I want. But this is one of the ones I really, really wanted. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I gotta get this out. My hands are like shaky right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't get it out because I'm just like... I'm like, okay, I'm like drugstore diva. I'm not gonna lie. I love everything drugstore. Anything that's not from the drugstore, I kind of freak out about. Because I've just never been able to have that sort of luxury. Oh my gosh, how do you get it out? <laughs> I really hope you like the stuff I got. I didn't really, I don't know. Is there a special way to open this? Because I sure don't know how to <laughs> open it. <sighs> okay, how is one supposed to open this without ripping up the package? <gasps> there we go. Oh my goodness. It's so cute. <laughs> It's a little baby palette. Okay. Gotta look at these and I gotta look. Oh my goodness. That is amazing. You have spoiled me. Mm mm. Ah. <sighs> Thank you so much, Leah. I cannot begin to thank you fully for just the effort that you put into this box. I think that's all, guys. Um, and, yeah, I will try to link my 
um, link in my video that, let's see, I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. I think I'll try to link the video that I made of the stuff that I sent her in the description box. So, um, yeah, maybe in the next couple videos or so, I'll have maybe some demos or tutorials or something um, in my next couple videos of the stuff that she got me. So, I guess I will see you guys later. Bye!